And they're off. Perfect chances quick into stride. Perfect chances comes out running for the early lead. And Baytown Storm is there to the inside. Citizen Judy away running in third. Then Rio De Paz is fourth. Misty Sunday is in the fifth position. position. And Baytown Amy Rose is last of the six as they round the far turn. Perfect chances in front. Gets over to the rail. Around that far turn. Leads at a length and a half. Citizen Judy goes second up on the outside. Baytown Storm is back toward the inside in third. Rio De Paz looks toward the far outside. Still seven from the front. They turn for home, and Perfect Chances is the leader. Perfect Chances on top by two lengths, chased all the way by Citizen Judy, moving into the final furlong. Her holy name is now up to third, but is still six lengths behind the leader, and the leader's coming to the 16th pole. Perfect Chances in front for Walter Rodriguez. Perfect Chances winning here at Keeneland. Citizen Judy was across the line in second, then her holy name was third, and Baytown Storm was fourth. Well, uh, the first horse by Stallion Chancelot wins, and that is perfect chances, exactly as Wesley Ward told us, she's fast. She's fast. She doesn't know how much farther she can get, but she doesn't need to get much farther than four and a half furlongs. And you can see Walter Rodriguez taking a little peek behind himself because uh, there was a filly that was making a little bit of a late bid here coming down the stretch, but Philly is just... They're so well prepared, Todd. This filly broke about a length in front of the rest of the field, and that's all that matters in these baby races. Off at one to two, completing the four and a half furlongs in 52 seconds. Your order of finish on the board, nine, two, three, one. One to two, over 13 to one, over three to one, over nine to one. So the day has started, post-time favorite, post-time favorite.